हेलो माई सोल फैमिली हाउ आर यू ऑल एंड आई होप यू आर डूइंग ग्रेट वंडरफुल अमेजिंग एंड सेफ वे एवर यू आर इन द वर्ल्ड आई वेलकम यू ऑल इन माई चैनल एंड थैंक यू सो मच फॉर लाइकिंग शेयरिंग एंड सब्सक्राइबिंग टू द चैनल एंड इफ यू हैव नॉट सब्सक्राइब ये टू द चैनल देन प्लीज लाइक शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब टू द चैनल एंड यू कैन ऑल्सो लेट मी नो इन द कमेंट सेक्शन एंड यू कैन टेल मी एनी थिंग वॉट एवर यू वॉन्ट टू so let's start today's video and in this video we are going to know about what is a cdt plate this cdt plate uh, we have listened a lot in the series which we have completed uh, okay just before we have completed that series and in that series we get to know that there is a cdt plate so in this video we are going to discuss in detail that what is the meaning of this cdt plate so let's start today's video so the full form of cdt plates is cloister dura tora plates okay cdt plates is a series of 12 pre atlantean silver holographic disc records from 2 lakh 48000 years ago they are small pale silver physical disc that contains massive amounts of practical physical and spiritual evolution advancements known as sacred spiritual science teachings that are translated by the three speakers okay so the three cdt plate speakers or translators of the cloister dura tora plates are always contemporaries that means they occur all at the same timeline and work closely and cooperatively together collectively presenting on earth the translations to which they are commissioned over a 12 period of time so they are commissioned over a 12 period of time the cdt plates are holographic recordings storage and transmission devices that hold massive amounts of data in encrypted electromagnetic scalar standing wave form they were manufactured from a form of straightened selenite crystal quartz organic to the density universe 2 which is dimension 456 planet cirrus b surrounding radioactive isotopic core encased in a hybrid metal silver alloy compound organic to earth so they contain the full evolutionary history of life evolution in our time matrix since the last life wave was seeded 950 billion years ago up to the present and also the future records of many various parts of evolutionary development of human and interdimensional intergalactic intertime race races which emerge from free will choice rendered in our present time space continuum they are presented to the race of our 15 dimensional time matrix by the density universe 5 which is dense, uh, dimension 13 14 and 15 which are the beings elohai elohim emerald order seraphai seraphim order baharama amethyst order the three primary founder races in our time matrix the translations of the data from cdt plates is accomplished through the initiation of specific frequency transmissions through which the disk activate to release the stored data in the chosen form of holographic audio visual or digital translation among the numerous subjects included in the cdt plates are number 1 is the melchizedek cloister law of one spiritual science okay Uh, number one is melchizedek cloister the second one is law of one spiritual studies the number three is kelontic morphogenetic matter template science 15 dimensional unified physics field physics primary creation mechanics advanced markaba dna biogenesis ascension mechanics kathara co template healing and that is kathara healing okay so planetary templar stage stargate mechanics pre ancient history founder races and angelic race evolution higher sensory perception that is out of body travels book of maps and key and the key and the technical manual for earth's hall of amenti stargates and the planetary templar complex systems CDT plates also serve as a dual purpose in relation to obtaining manual access to the 12 primary stargates of the universal templar complex 
CDT plates are a part of a larger apparatus as this includes 12 corresponding larger silver discs called the signet shields. One of the translator speakers for CDT plate was the John the Baptist from 31 BC to 34 BC and the other speaker was the leader of the Essene that was Joshua Melchizedek known as Jesus Christ. Now this is the right of all angelic humans to have this information. It has been withheld here on earth because this has been controlled by the fallen angelics or we can call them dark fallen angelics. It has been treated as a slave planet. So there is other translations that have occurred within this world. So these disc have been in cons in custody that is protective custody within the azurite iani priest or or family lines since a catalysm event that took place on earth in 28216 bc that was a drag invasion which was happened and there was a stellar activation cycle which occurred okay so before that date there was uh, they were in a protective custody of the urtite lineage which was the urtite was the host race okay for the third seeding so they were in a protective custody of the urtite lineage or the human lineage okay or the angelic human lineage angelic human cloister is a collective organization for the purpose of preservation of this information the maharatha is the ancient sacred text translation of the founder races cdt plates from 246000 bc which originally contain 590 volumes and over 5 lakh pages of non dogmatic egalitarian sacred spiritual science teachings covering every aspect of mastering personal and cosmic reality now, before intentional editing and distortions by the hand of the fallen angelics and corrupt human power elite, the teachings of every traditional religious belief systems on earth, from Christianity to Buddhism to Hinduism and other tribal oral tradition originally emerged from re-translations of the Maharatha texts and CDT plates. CDT plates have massive amounts of digital, digitally stored information on the history of our time matrix, on the creation of humans and on Emerald Covenant. Emerald Covenant is a co-creative agreement or a co-evolution agreement between all the races in a time matrix from the highest levels to co-evolve together into peace and to help each other to get back to where we all had our ability to ascend at will. So we are, we were not trapped any vote anymore and to get back our original divine blueprint back. The CDT plates are physical and they have been brought into density at different timelines. They contain massive records on the science of the Templar, the science of which are the energy systems in the planetary grids and the star gates. They contain massive information on the stair step creation model, which is explaining how we get here and where we came from and how we got back and what's the objective of this game. There is always an intention and purpose and intelligence behind that created that purpose and intention. The CDT plates are the seeds of all religions on the planet Earth. The CDT plates were given to us 2,48,000 years ago as a part of a restatement of the original Emerald Covenant to help bring peace to this planet and to the races on this planet Earth that were part human but also part of some ancient stellar races that had infiltrated this culture. All the information on the CDT plates are drawn from the ecatic level of the energy matrix. All of the religion evolved from the attempts of the higher angelics to bring that information back to us at times. That would bring these CDT plates, little silver discs that hold this data. You have to learn how to learn how to run frequency through your kundalini in your body. Run it through your arm if you are holding them and throw it into the palm chakra. Push it into the disc and the disc would begin to vibrate within itself and it would hit a certain level of vibration 
vibration and it would pop out holographic dramas as it would give you literally the holographic movie projected onto the air where you could watch the history unfold and you could learn to mentally command it to stop or start or to go to the certain timeline period. This is a technology that was built from the angelic legions. It was a technology that had partial ex a partial access to uh, in to an Atlantean periods. Okay, Joshua was commissioned to be the speaker. He was having a speaker's contract, which means that he was trained from very young age to able to access information from the CDT plates on the behalf of the Briona collectives, on the behalf of the Iani conscious field of sound, on the behalf of of source on the behalf of God to bring that information back here. So now we get to know that the CDT plates, these are the ancient records exist in physical form as a set of 12 silver metallic discs called the Cloister Dora Tura plates, libraries or the CDT plates. The 12 CDT plates are holographic recording, okay, storage and transmission device that hold massive amount of data in encrypted electromagnetic scalar standing waveforms. And translations of data from CDT plate libraries is accomplished through initiation of specific frequency transmission through which the disk activate to release their stored data in the chosen form of holographic audio, visual or digital translation. The 12 CDT plates were manufactured from a form of stradite selenite quartz crystal organic to the density universe to planet B. Okay, so now the CDT plates were manufactured by the Taran priest of Ur and the Maharaji Syrian blue human, which was the holy grey line races of the Council of Azoline, which is often collectively called as the Azorites or the Iani races on the density universe 2, which is dimension 4, 5 and 6, Cyrus B, Guardian Alliance Signet Council 6 and the Guardians of dimension 6, the Cyrus B target 6 in the Universal Templar Complex. In 2,46,000 BC, CDT plates were presented as a gift to the Urtite human race, the seed race of the contemporary human lineage. By the Azurite races, Cyrus B, in honor of the Urtites, entering the Founder Races Emerald Covenant Co-Evolution Agreement Peace Treaty. The CDT plates contain massive and corrupted tones of practical, physical and spiritual evolution advancement teachings presented to the races of our 15 dimensional time matrix by the density universe 5, uh, density universe 5, which is dimension 13 to 15, Elohai, Elohim, Emerald Order, Seraphite, Seraphim, Gold Order and Baharama, Amethyst Order, Melchizedek, Cloister, Bruno, the three primary founder races in our time matrix. The teachings contained in the CDT plates cover the full evolutionary history of our life evolution at time matrix since the life was seeded 950 billion years ago up to the present. The CDT plates also contain the future records of many various parts of evolutionary development of human and interdimensional intergalactic intertime races which emerged from free will choices rendered in a space time continuum in our present space time continuum of the existing probable futures or the primary time vectors of evolutionary development that exist as future experimental potentials are present movement choices determine which line of probable evolution will be perceived in manifest form as a future continuum of time emerging from a present space time coordinate. Most valuable to our present time, the CDT plates contain extensive education recordings pertaining to founder race creation mechanics, which is universal unified field physics and the law of one inner Christ, sacred spiritual science, ascension Merkaba training. The CDT plate also contain the history and details of the founder emerald covenant co-evolution agreement peace treaty humanity historical relations relationship to the emerald covenant as designated by the emerald covenant restatement of 246000 bc the cdt plates contain the teachings of masters templar mechanics which is on the planetary galactic and universal stargate mechanics level 
DNA template biogenesis and Kathara code template healing technologies. These master tech teachings were originally provided to the angelic human race in order to humanity in order for humanity to fulfill its original creation commission. We were created as the guardians and keepers of the universal Templar complex, so that these master teachings were provided originally to the angelic human race in order for humanity so that they can fulfill their creation commission as guardians and the keepers of the universal Templar complex. The CDT plates have served as an instant part of human evolution on earth since they were given to Oritites in 246000 BC. The first written translation of the of part of the CDT plate library was transmitted by the Oritite human race of earth upon receiving the CDT plates in 246000 BC. The first written CDT plate records were a collection of large books collectively called Maharata, pronounced Maharata, translated into the inner Christos dispensions. The Maharata text was a collection of over 5 lakh pages of condensed text transcription spanning 590 volumes. The Maharata transcriptions were handwritten on a form of durable textile paper resembling crips, semi -transluent, uh, transluent vellum that was in common use at that time among the Taran civilizations of the density universe 2, which is dimension 4, 5, and 6. The volume of the the volumes of the Maharata were compiled in large format embroised leather bound books through a hand rendered process that resembles contemporary perfect binding the original maharata books were transcribed in the anuhazi language that was the first spoken written language form of the density universe 4 emerald order elohai elohim anuhazi feline hominite founder races out of which all external languages forms in a time matrix emerged the 12 CDT plates were kept on earth in the protective custody of Oritite human lineage until the temple wars which was happened in 2,8216 BC which resulted the pole shift in which there was a draconian invasion which was happened during the stellar activation cycle. Okay, uh, The grids were started running on reverse 10 code pulse. Just prior to the 2,8216 BC pole shift and decimation of the Urtite human culture, 10 of the 12 CDT plates were retrieved by the Cyrus B. Azurite races and placed under Azurite Universal Templar Security Team protection. The CDT plates have always always been greatly desired by many interstellar races not only for the practical knowledge they contain but also due to their dual purpose in relation to obtaining manual access to the 12 primary stargates of the Universal Templar Complex. The 12 CDT plates are a part of larger apparatus that included 12 corresponding larger silver discs called the signet shields. Okay, as we get to know that the 12 signet shields manufactured at the same time as the CDT plates as the technology through which the 12 primary stargates of the universal Templar complex which span the dimensional fields and galaxies of dimension 1 to 12 can manually activate it and open. The 12 CDT plates designed for inter- the 12 CDT plates designed for interdimensional frequency transmission capacity can be used to manually activate from remote locations the signet shields and their corresponding universal stargates. The 12 CDT plate discs are the activators for the 12 signet shields. In the wrong hands, the CDT plate signet shield technology could bring universal devastation to this time matrix. So the CDT plates remained under the highest security possible. On the behalf of Emerald Order Milches de Cloister, Elohai Elohim Bruno of the Density Universe 5 and their primary guardian universal service organization, which is the Azurite Universal Templar Security Team, the IAFW and the 12 Signet Councils of the Guardian Alliance, the CDT plate Signet Shield Protection has been commissioned to the Azurite races, the Cyrus B Council of Azuline. 
the urtite human lineage of earth was entrusted with the protection of the cdt plates and signet shields in 246000 bc when humanity was officially appointed as active co-guardians of the universal templar complex through the uni through the uh, urtites enter into the emerald covenant restatement the guardian alliance signet council 6 the council of ezraline from cyrus b reclaimed 10 of the 12 cdt plates under their protection in 2 lakh 8216 bc and two of the 12 cdt plates and all 12 signet shields fell in the hands of various competing human and fallen angelic legions on earth during the course of human evolution since the time in the 1600s, the Azurites secured one of the missing CDT plates and in November of 1999, the last of the 12 CDT plates, once called the Table of Testimony by the Knights Templar races, was retrieved by the Azurites from a contemporary Freemason family line through which possession of the CDT plate has been, had been passed from Atlantan generations. In the 12 CDT shields still remain buried in various hidden locations of, on earth. Since the time of 2,8216 BC Catholicism, the Azurite races of Cyrus B. Council of Azurine has periodically offered dispensations of knowledge translation translated from the CDT plates to the evolving human cultures on earth. The translations of the CDT plates were the first foundations of all legitimate spiritual teachings among all the races on, of earth. Before the gen genuine CDT plate translations were repeatedly compromised, destroyed and distorted into the religious control dogmas by competing factions of corrupt human power allied and fallen angelic visitors. Each time the Azurites offer return of the CDT plate translations, the three CDT plate speaker incarnate through the Maharaji race line council of Azurine, which is the stargate number six, from Cyrus B into the human indigo child gray line on earth. Okay, because they are the master, uh, they are the security team, okay to serve as the three CDT plate translators or the speakers. The first CDT plate speaker is trained for the position from childhood through physical contact with Azurite races and priest of Ur and serve as a mentor for CDT plate speakers 2 and 3. The three CDT, speaker, CDT plate speakers are always contemporary and work closely and cooperatively together, collectively presenting on earth the translations of the CDT plate to which they are commissioned over a 12 period of time. The tradition of selecting only three CDT plate speakers who are entrusted members of the Emerald Order incarnate in a human form is a security is a security measure that has always been employed by the Azurite races in order to protect the integrity and intended purity of the CDT plate translations. In Atlantean times, the most commonly known third CDT plate speaker was a Niburan Anunnaki Atlantan by the name of Thoth. In 2340 BC, Thoth was entrusted by the Emerald Order Melchizedek Cloister and Azurite races to bring oral translations of the part of one CDT plate into specific segments of Atlantean culture. During this time, Thoth defected from the Emerald Covenant in favor of Niberian Anunnaki dominant agendas, translating portions of the CDT plate into the written form in a text that became known as Emerald Tablets of Thoth. Thoth presented the Emerald Tablets to then a corrupt Anu Melchizedek priesthood of Atlantis, which culminated in the final destruction of the Atlantean Islands in 9558 BC and subsequent chaos of human evolution in the, since the colonization of Sumerian culture. In 2040 BC, another attempt to bring translations of the CDT play to earth was rendered through an individual by the name of Enoch, who served as the second CDT play speaker in that time period. Enoch's CDT plate translation consisted of three volumes of history that were once contained in the Maharata, the Book of Amenti, the Angelic Rosters, and the Book of the Dragon. 
In 10 BC, the three Essene CDT played speakers known as John the Baptist, Jesus Christ, which was Jeshua Sanada Melchizedek, born 12 BC, and Mariam collectively translated nine additional books from the CDT plates, creating the original foundations of what was intended to become the legitimate Christina, Christian doctrine. These books included Jeshua's six books of process detailing self-generated ascension mechanics, core template biorigenes, and the books of maps and keys, the technical manual for Earth's halls of MNT stargates, and planetary Templar co complex system. The translations of Mariam were the three books of the cloister, one translated in the Maharatha text, detailing culture structures built upon the founder's Emerald Covenant model. The Templar mechanics books of the John the Baptism were not completed as he was murdered prior to the completion of the CDT play translation. The books of Enoch, Joshua and Mariam represent 12 of the 15 missing books of the Bible that were originally part of the legitimate Essene Grey Line teachings. The Essene teachings were intentionally edited and distorted in 325 AD by the Council of Nicaea and the Church of Rome to create the controlled dogma religion presented as the canonized Bible. The Cathari of the southern France held some of the original Essene records of the Jeshuham and Mariam until the Church of Rome ordered killing of the Cathari in 1244 AD. Cathars maintain a church hierarchy, but they rejected any idea of priesthood or the church buildings. They refuse to eat animals. They do not take oath. They treat men equal women. Okay. They believed in reincarnations. Okay. So what has happened in before their demise, the Cathari hits hid uh, hide portions of their genuine Essene records along with one of the 12 signet shields that had been in their possessions. Literally, they were killed and they were burnt alive with the fire. Okay. These relics will, will be eventually discovered in contemporary times. Okay. Other CDT plates translations of the ancient times were dispensed through speakers born into Hindu, Chinese, Tibetan, African, Egyptian, Mayan, Incan and Celtic Druidic grey lines. Since the ancient pre ancient uh, since pre ancient times, all CDT play translations seeded into every earthly culture have suffered the same fate of destruction or this or distortion. Since two lakh eight thousand two sixteen BC, translations of the CDT plates were repeatedly given by the priest of Ur Azurite races in order to prepare Earth humanity for the next scheduled stargate opening cycle, which we called as Steeler Activation Cycle or SAC. During the next Steeler Activation Cycle to follow, the failed Steeler Activation Cycle of 2,8216 BC, the angelic human race of Earth would be called upon by the Azurites and the guardian races of the Emerald Covenant to assist in healing the Earth's damaged planetary Templar complex. When the next Steeler Activation Cycle arrived on Earth, humanity would also be asked to peacefully help and assist guardian angelic nations in protecting earth's hall of mnt stargates from fallen angelic race dominion since 22346 bc all interdimensional races knew that the next probable stellar activation cycle on earth would occur between 2000 to 2017 the Emerald Covenant, the Emerald Order, Melchizedek, Cloister found, Founder Races, Azurite Races and the Nations of the Emerald Covenant are again returning translations of the CDT play to humanity in preparation for the intended mass visitation that will occur if Earth can safely guide it through the now commencing 2000 to 2017 Steeler activation cycles. So this was the meaning of CDT plate which was cloister Dora Chora plates and I hope I make you all understand why it was necessary to, ma uh, to um, know the meaning of CDT plates okay and why um, and every time why it was being given again and again during different timelines to the humans okay to the angelic humans 
so i hope i make you understand still if you have any questions you can ask me in the comment section sending you lots of love healing and happy energies to all my soul family who are watching my video take care of yourself and see you soon